New at six, the next step forward for medical marijuana in Alabama. In the next 24 hours, the remaining 11 members of the Alabama Medical Cannabis Commission will be appointed by state leaders. It won't be until 2022 that qualified patients will have access to medical marijuana in the state, but numbers for pre-registration to receive a card shows a lot of people are already interested. Wait 31's Ashley Carter joins us live after speaking with one company's patient care specialist who's been working to pre-register people in the state. And Ashley, the interest obviously is certainly there. And companies like Green Health Doc are seeing patients here in Alabama, dozens of them each and every week. So much so that the patient care specialist I spoke with told me that she's booked out into mid to late July. And she says that She's walked me through what that registration process will look like and how it will actually benefit people come next year. We're more or less just getting our getting ahead of the game. You know, we, we want to offer those answers rather than waiting for people to come to us. Owl Art is a patient care specialist for Green Health Docs. She acts as a liaison for people interested in getting medical marijuana in states that have new cannabis programs. She says she has about 10 people sign up a day to speak with her. Actually training another patient care specialist to take on more of the Alabama load so that we can get more patients seen. Many of the people art consults have chronic pain or PTSD. She says it's beneficial for people interested in medical marijuana to go through the pre-registration process so in registration does begin, they can be seen by a physician faster. Pre-registration is more or less just a process that we've developed internally that makes it easier for us to get people on the schedule with the doctors based on the severity of their cases um, and like the, the availability of our providers. But it will be more than a year before those patients will be able to receive their medical cards. The state's Medical Cannabis Commission will work over the next year to issue licenses for growing marijuana in the state. The application for those licenses don't open until September of 2022. It's why ARD says pre-registration can be really beneficial if you're in need. We have a huge number of post-traumatic stress patients who are decompensating like drastically. Their mental health has deteriorated to the point that they're not able to care for themselves effectively. And those are the sort of people that I consider a priority needs case. And they'll be some of the first patients that I reach out to to get treatment. Once that commission is fully appointed tomorrow, they will start having regular meetings beginning in July. Live in Huntsville, Ashley Carter, Way 31 News.